Uh-huh. Oh, boy. Uh. I like this hat. Yeah, it looks cool, honey. What? Wait a second. What? Oh. Oh. What the? Uh, Who are you? I'm sorry, but have we met before? I don't think I've ever seen you before. Yeah, I've never uh, seen you. You sure about that? Because last I remembered, you're dating Sonic and you're married to Rouge. What? Uh, I broke up with my Rouge. I'm with her now. And her Sonic broke up with her. Yeah. Yeah, Sonic broke up with me. Oh boy. Oh dear, we got one of those uh people from that that other universe that that little uh wooden tinker boy is from. Yeah, I guess so. Guess so. Uh but yeah, yeah, I'm so I'm so sorry for uh intruding on you guys like that. Oh my god. But I'm favorite piece by the way. Oh. I mean, it's okay. Uh Okay. I'm cool, Amy. And I'm cool, Knuckles. Nice to meet ya. Um, oh, hey, nice, nice to meet you. Hey, this is the, uh, cool right? That's right. I guess that's yes. what people call it, since we're the cooler versions of the multiple Sonic universes. My girlfriend, Amy, she dragged me here. Want to do some shopping? Well, I can carry my bags, Nucky. Yeah, true. I'm the one with the muscles. <laughs> she shops a lot. Yeah, you're very strong, Nucky. Oh, 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 oh boy. <laughs> I'd like to look pretty for you, Nucky. Of course you do. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Who's my pretty pink princess? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Follow, follow. <laughs> oh, boy. Know what to, uh, what to give the Sonic in my dimension that I'm from, uh, pointers, I mean, what? Huh? <laughs> well, let's just say for where I'm at, uh, pretty much there is a Sonic and Amy that are together, but thankfully, Amy has mellowed out and Sonic learned to stop being so shy. Really? And well, that's a surprise. And, yes, it and is. Also plus there, and also, plus there's another and Rouge there. They are married, but... Wait. Oh, are they? Hold on. Oh, Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Are you referring to the one from that other dimension that's either sells those coin things or the weed stuff? Your Nux coin, what they call it? Yeah, I'm referring to that one there, and let's just say, yeah, the Nux coin. Still not doing so well. Oh, but, oh embarrassing. Um, no. That's ripping but people off. Right, yeah, but at least on the bright side, though, at least with the, at least when the other one is not smoking weed, at least he's pretty chill and actually knows when he needs to, late when he knows when he can and cannot smoke it or eat it. Oh, God. How oh, embarrassing. Oh, well, could be more so. At least, at least the one who smokes the weed is straight. Meanwhile, a lot of people are having questions about the one that tries to scam people when it comes to his uh, <clears throat> preferences on who he's trying to cheat on Rouge with. Oh, God. Well, if he's smart, he'll get out of there. Because being with a Rouge is nothing but trouble. It's caused me nothing but trouble. That's why her and I separated. Yeah, 
Yeah, and you're also talking to, um, you're also talking to Bruges' roommate here as well. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, no idea how many times I had to keep, oh, really? try to keep her away from my jewelry. But... Oh, don't even get me started. How many times oh. she's stolen Amy from, sorry, she's stolen jewels from Amy. Wow. <sighs> Probably a lot, yeah. Our rouge stuff <sighs> too. Still heals every now and then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially to try to steal, keep stealing the Master Emerald well, from Naki. Oh, don't even get me started on that. I can't tell you how many times she steals the Master Emerald. Ugh. Yeah. For all I know, she could be stealing it right now. Oh dear, no one that Don't jinx it. <laughs> oh god, something tells me I already but... did. All you say is that, that, that room there needs to get needs to get over it and move on and stop stealing and stop stealing that master emerald because at least with Bruce, my my universe at least the most she does with it is just talk to it and lay and lay on it whenever she's bored. I see. Well, tell me, uh, at least one thing that's different between yours and ours is she's actually with a shadow. Yeah, fortunately. Mm-hmm. As long as it's at this dimension, Shadow, I think we'll be covered, because let's just say... The Shadow the shadow I'm more familiar with... Well, technically there are two Shadows I know, but, uh, one Shadow is a giant, is a giant simp for Rouge, but he simps so hard to get the <laughs> crap out of everybody. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh, that's and hilarious. <laughs> And also, funny thing too, whenever there's a chicken around, he says a certain word that also means chicken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's really funny. <laughs> Sounds like a real loser. <laughs> yes. Oh, no then, wonder he's not with Rouge. Yeah, and then the other shot, and then the other shadow I know he well. Surprisingly enough, the only worst quality he has is that he has an addiction to ramen, but otherwise, he's a pretty serious shadow and actually gets with the program when needing to be edgy. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> yeah. Well, our shadow is pretty much, you know, what you'd expect from a shadow. Edgy, you know, grumpy, mm -hmm. you know, all that stuff. Yeah. Does, does he also, does he ha also have a soft spot for adorable little kittens? Mmm, that I don't know. I'd have to ask, though he'd probably punch me in the face. Oh, yeah, how many what? times he punched you in the face, Naki? <laughs> 72 times. Oh, dear. 72 times. Dang. Yes. Ugh, I hate that fake black hedgehog. <laughs> and here I thought Sonic was the only one that calls him a faker. <laughs> They're all fakers, if you ask me. <laughs> Him, Silver, yeah. all of them. They're all hedgehogs. <laughs> well, your girl's a hedgehog. Well, oh, she's the only exception. Yeah. She yeah. doesn't try to fight me. <laughs> but yeah, well, what about what about you and uh, your Sonic Bear, Amy? Um, well, I used to date Sonic, but he kind of break up with me. Unable to handle the commitment. Uh, probably I'd be too clinging of him. Hmm. Yeah. Well, not sure about that. I mean, is he often clingy? Is she often clingy with you, or do you just not care? Hmm. I just don't really care. She was with me. She was my second in command during the war with Eggman, and well, after it was mm -hmm. all over, that's when she broke up with her Sonic. So, yeah, you know, we've been together for about six months. Yes. Oh, I guess you I could say I kind of took her in. Mm -hmm. uh, now, Sonic. Sonic. Oh, thank you. And Sonic, he's with this new girl, some ferret or lemur or whatever she is, some girl with a big long tail. Is she, is she, uh, white and gray? Yes. Yes. Okay. I have, because I, because I know I've seen this one pop up in my universe. I believe her name is Tangle. 
Yeah, that was her name. Right. Yes, Jith. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I've met her. She's uh, okay, I guess. I didn't see her very much. Well, oh, whatever. All I can say is whatever quotes quote the hedgehogs about, am I right? Yeah. Yeah. He's. I say those two are a lot alike. I tell you, it's like she's a female version of him, only she's not a hedgehog. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh dear. Yeah. Hold on. Wait a minute. Are there gender bents in your universe? Just quick question. There. Uh -huh. There are a few. However, they come from another dimension that's actually gender bent. Uh, oh lord. Let's just say. Yeah. Oh, no. um, well, let's say in that case, Bigfoot <laughs> doesn't like gender bents. <laughs> that's well, just creepy. Well, not all of them are. Well, thankfully not all of them are. Well, what you imagine. Because, uh. yeah, there's a, obviously there's a Sonica, or female Sonic. She is actually really chill. Oh, oh boy. And then, and oh, yes, boy. there's a male version of Amy. He calls himself Alex Thorne, but he's, he's, a, he's an adorable little kid. Oh, oh boy, here's a and, male version of you. Oh, uh, God. And, is there a, but, hold on. Is there a female version of me? rumors about it, but I can't confirm. Oh, boy. That's just weird. A girl version of me. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, calm down. Calm down. Listen, 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 listen. Calm down. But, however, there is a... Well, technically, there's two two of them, but there are two versions of uh, female Shadow. She calls herself oh. Shadina, but I say two versions because... Uh, Let's just say there was an incident that happened a while back, and it caused Shadina to split into two girls. One of them, stereotypically edgy, and the other one, apparently they call her the nice Shadina. I call her the squeakier one because, well, she tends to be a bit more, obviously more nicer, more uh, open with her emotions, and she squeaks a lot whenever somebody boops her or messes with her hair. Huh. You don't say. Well, that's completely unlike a shadow, if you ask me. Because <laughs> most shadows are just, you know, mean, grumpy, and edgy. But a nice one? Yeah. Well, that's hard to believe. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I kind of have one. Yeah, that's why I pretty much I believe that, hey, wouldn't the split have happened with Shadina? That obviously there's the cooler, edgier one that most people see. And that the nicer one is something that Shadow often hides. Oh yeah, the nice side. Oh yeah, I, all shadows have a soft spot dig down somewhere in there. They just don't like to show it. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Some, yeah, sometimes they don't show it too much, or you gotta force it out of them. Hmm. Oh, that's impossible. Yeah. Our shadow will never show his nice yeah. side. No, he never shows. Unless he shows it over to Rouge, but then again, I don't think that's any of our business. <laughs> no. I'd yeah, rather stay out of that. <laughs> yeah, me too. Well, anyway, what about you? What's your story? Hmm? How did you end up here? Yeah. Well, uh, pretty much, I guess I didn't pay attention again while I was uh, exploring around. I have teleported over to here, because I just wanted to at least, you know, get a look around here on Mobius, but looks like I wind up teleporting right place, wrong dimension. Um, but from for me here, I'm I'm actually not from Mobius. I'm a sailor scout. A sailor scout. And sailor yeah. scout. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Never heard yeah, of them. They are pretty much they're pretty much uh, Universal war war Warriors, Planetary Guardians uh, that help out with protecting each, each planet there, and hence why I got a Sailor outfit on. <laughs> oh, I see. Interesting. Yeah, it's pretty cute. <laughs> oh, <laughs> thank you. Anyways, um, but um, yeah, but however, however, before, however, I normally don't always look like this because I know that I take the form of a hedgehog, but and I actually have a human, I have a human appearance. So really, but once I. Oh. Mm -hmm. And when I, I had appeared here, I was still human. Kind of took a while to try to finally blend in and be my own, 
be my own Mobian self, and so this is what I am now. Hmm. <laughs> Aww. I see. Interesting. An interesting story. Mm -hmm. So, but, but yeah, the movie, well, the movie is where I'm from. The mod, or modern dimension I had recently became, became their, uh, the planet's uh, sailor guardian there. Initially, I traveled throughout the multiverse for a while to help bring balance to it, and then uh, pretty much my travels led me right here, and it turned out that, uh, very much technically is where my final mission is supposed to be, and, well, found out that they needed a sailor guardian, and I took up the mantle. I see. So you're a guardian. Well, I must, from one guardian to another, Keep up the good work. Oh, <laughs> thanks, yes. Max. Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. No problem. That's what us guardians do. We keep the uh, we keep our universes safe. Right, honey? Yep. Mine, yep. Mine, Matthew's the first guardian. Oh, gee, shucks. <laughs> honey, you're embarrassing me. Cute when he's flustered. <laughs> well, well, at least I know how you feel, Knuckles. My boyfriend flusters me all the time, too. <laughs> oh, I see. Is he a human, too? Aww. Uh, surprisingly, no. He's a hedgehog. He's a purple lion, but we call him Chris. Oh. Okay. Aww. Yeah, and. But yeah, but yeah, funnily enough, he also came from another dimension as well, and besides, besides, well, having lightning attacks like I do, he also wield, wields a Keyblade as well. Oh. Does he play Kingdom Hearts? Oh, oh boy, he does. <laughs> I thought so. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. I do play video games yeah. here and there, every now and then. Yeah, yeah, me too. I also met Sora. He's a pretty cool kid. Oh, that's cool. He sounds uh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I've always wanted to see what that, that dimension looks like. Yeah, me too. Yeah, who, knows, maybe, who knows, maybe one day we may be able to end up running into that one. Well, what? how my teleporting tends to be lately... I would not be surprised if I accidentally run in, run into run into that dimension. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <sighs> Seems like well, you're not the only one who's come over to this dimension. There's this other little black robot kid that keeps coming over here to see cream. Black oh, robot yeah. kid. Yeah, he's got like a jetpack he... and green bag and he looks like a looks like a little imp or something. I believe his name oh, is Bokun. Oh yeah, that's his name, Bokun. Yeah, he keeps he keeps coming over here because uh, he's with our cream. Our cream. I'm. Sh mm -hmm. Is your cream with tails in your universe? Yes, yes, she is. I thought so. Ours isn't, unfortunately. Uh, he's yeah. he's seeing this other girl. This uh, the the female version of that wooden boy. What's Belle, the tinkerer. Yeah, that's her name. I yeah. haven't met Belle her yet. Tinker, yeah. I've only met that little yeah, wooden, her, the yeah. male version of her. Okay. Yeah, I haven't, yeah. Yeah, I haven't seen Belle, Belle in a while, but I hope she's alright. Well, yeah, ours is fine. She's with her uh, Eggman or Mr. Tinker or whatever he prefers to be called now. Yeah. Uh, probably our Eggman is retired. <laughs> Oh, yeah. so Egghead finally retired. Hmm. <sighs> well, that doesn't mean I'm not keeping an eye on him. No. I don't blame yeah. him, but, but it, all I can say is if modern Eggman ever retires, that would be a miracle and a half. Uh, don't count your eggs before they hatch, because uh, just because our Eggman's retired doesn't mean all the other Eggmans in the multiverse are going to retire. And they're probably still going to be evil. Yeah. Most likely. Yeah. Anyhow, here, so. Well, I would love to stick around for a little longer, but 
looks like I had gotten a message that my that my presence is needed, so. But it was nice to meet the two of you. It was nice to meet you two as well. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> You're welcome here anytime. Sorry, I keep forgetting. Hey, no problem there. Yes, yes. Sorry, I keep forgetting how big your hands are compared oh. to mine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Nice to meet you as well. And honey, I think. <laughs> yeah, honey, uh, I think we better get back to the to the Master Emerald Shrine. I've been way too long, and I need to check up on that thing. Yeah, it's no. probably a good idea. <laughs> yeah. Remember, never trust a rude. Oh, trust me, I won't. Yeah. Well, anyway, uh, so long, Sailor Scout girl. Oh. Bye. See you later. Bye bye. Yeah, we gotta get going here. Uh, I have a feeling there's... I don't know, I just had this feeling that I need to go back and see the Master Emerald. Alright, let's go, honey. Come on. Yeah.